the temperatures up, get the tires all nice and clean, and then he will make his way to the destination ramp zone and proceed to have that car get, go through the air at almost 75 miles an hour and go over 160 feet. What did you say? He went 163 feet last weekend? Yeah, that was the record he had every week. He's beaten it every single week. Now he's making his way around these cars he gets every week are brand new cars he's been given. And has a very limited amount of time to be able to prepare these cars, get that roll cage ready inside there, because when he lands, there's a lot of G-forces. And trust me, people, this is not easy. He makes it look Mad, simple. Mad Max, Tim Tripwood gave me the go sign. He said he's doing it this time. Fans, make some noise. Get on your team. Chris Marino. Mark Lockenstone. Hold on. Oh, 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 my goodness. At least he didn't land upside down like he's done the last couple of weeks, Mad Max. He's out of the well, they're checking him out already. Safety crews are on the scene. He's moving around in the car, but the most important thing is Mad Max, we want to see him pull out under his own power. Once again, you never know every single week, a dangerous stunt to be able to jump that car that distance. He's being checked right now. And safety crews are getting ready to get out of the track. The ambulance starting up now. That's a safety precaution to make sure that Chris Moreno is okay. 